A weekend avalanche has killed a Rocky Mountain House hockey player and Red Deer native. As Nav Sanga reports, people in central Alberta are mourning the loss of a great teammate and an even better friend. Out comes Stasek. Over the line. Stasek fires. Scores! A lightning fast forward and determined leader on the ice. For more, Stasek with Johnston. Stasek fires. Scores! And a happy-go-lucky friend off it. Uh, 203, you reckon I'll go a nice light eight iron. Yeah. 21-year-old <laughs> Kale Stesic lived life to the fullest. But now his stall sits bare, except for his jersey. All kinds of, you know, memories on the road and, you know, waking him up to make sure he hits the bus in time, so. Last weekend, Stesic and two friends were in a closed area of the Lake Louise Ski Resort in Banff when they were caught in an avalanche. Two of the group escaped, but Stesic was buried under the snow and later died. It's just, it's still hard to believe, really. I'm, I'm not, I don't want to believe it. His death is felt throughout the central Alberta hockey community. Teams have changed their pictures on social media to honor his memory. He was a nice guy, never had anything bad to say about anyone that he ever met. Just a genuine guy and there's not very many left of those, so. Kill, you know, for us was a leader. He was uh, an assistant captain here um, and that spoke volumes. Uh, he was a leader on and, on and off the ice. The Rocky Rams are establishing a team award in his honor. Guys just, they wanted to play with Kale. They, you know, I don't think there was anybody that didn't like Kale. He was just a likable guy and, you know, um, he was great in the dressing room and just right over there. Landmark was one of Stesic's best friends, sharing fond memories of growing up together. Yeah, absolutely. Yeah, just hanging out until the cops come, so just, I'm, I'm going to miss him, and I think everybody else will, and just wish we could have did a lot more together. And <laughs> Nav Sanga, CTV News, Red Deer.